Come on, faster. Faster! You over, asshole! Come on, faster. Faster! Pass up anything useful. I thought all was lost. This kind of hunger makes people crazy. Some were saying we should eat the dead. We do that. How are we any different from those things out there? What you brought is a couple of more weeks of hope. Sadly, not for everybody. But you're probably wondering if we reach that guy on the radio, right? This may be our last chance out of here, friends. Yeah. Unfortunately, I don't have any good news. I told you our equipment turned out to be too weak. Dominic and a few others headed to the hotel to try the antenna there. We haven't heard from them for two days. So you're our last hope. You need to find them, and we need to pray that he's still alive. Because he's the only one who can get that hotel antenna up and running.
Ten after. Where the fuck is he? One on four point eight. Respond. This is the hotel. Maybe we should try again in an hour. An hour. One on four point eight. Are you there? Can you hear us? This is one on four point nine. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, hang tight. One on four point eight. Cause we're coming for you, buddy. That is, if the offer still stands. Of course. I'll call in a helicopter and we'll be evacuated to the nearest aircraft carrier. But first, you have to get here. We have wheels, we have gas, we'll get there. Wheels won't cut it. Well, why not? Where the hell are you? You see the ocean? That island on the horizon? If you had a high-powered telescope, you'd see me waving to you. That's where the prison is. Who the fuck are you? A convict? Speak! My name is Ryder White. I'm a colonel with the BIDF. Banoi Island Defence Force. I came to the prison to get my wife. A doctor, Emily White. Can we speak with her? What's that? Come again? We want to speak to I her. I told you, she's barely here. Beaten by one of the infected. She was trying to help him. Heal him. I only know all this because of her. Listen. You try to soften us up by making us feel sorry for your wife and then promise us a way off this goddamn island, all from a fucking prison? Of course we're gonna be suspicious. Who do you think I found you at the hotel? I'm a BDIF colonel, not some thug in a cell. So why don't you call your own people? Contact the fleet. Do you hear how bad the reception is? A bloody monsoon's coming. The fleet is 80 miles offshore in the middle of the storm. The satellite's down. We're cut off. Any more questions? He's telling the truth. And how would you know? She's not just a hotel desk clerk, right? Time's running out. You coming or what? I guess we don't have a choice. But first we need to find a goddamn boat. There's no point. This is benign. The prison is surrounded by a minefield. 
You have to find a guide through to the bunkers in Lintam and Gendi and find a smuggler called Moen. He knows the way. Bunkers? Japanese bunkers from the war. They're mostly destroyed, so you should have no problem entering. They will lead you inland. All right, White. We're taking you at your word. If this is some kind of con, I will personally take you off at the head. Trust me. It's us against them. We'll be in touch. So you can handle yourself pretty good out there. If you're heading for the jungle, then the fastest way is through the tunnel. I've been hearing shit, and I gotta say, the most dangerous animals out there are human. And I don't mean the dead ones. Shit's been going on there for years, way before this fucking pandemic hit. Two names keep coming up, Afran and Matutero. Stone Cold Killers is what I hear. So if that's where you're going, you watch your ass. You want to get into those old war bunkers, you're going to need something to blow through those armored doors. Let me see what I got. Maybe I could put something together with that Semtex you salvaged from that helicopter crash. Wonder why the hell they were flying around with that shit in the first place. Let me get to work putting together a fuse. Come back in a bit, and I'll have something you can actually use. Here you go. Just don't blow your balls off. And don't forget to bring somebody with who knows their way around. It's easy to get lost in there. You still here? I know you need to rest up, but time's running out, mate. Anything good in here? I heard we're heading into the bunkers. 
My mother said she used to play inside them before they were sealed. If we can get one of them open, we can head inland. Yeah. I can lead the way. Someone must have been hiding in that bunker and attracted their attention. I don't like this, but you do what you need to. them show up.
We're blowing it up? Okay. One, two... The sound of the blast is gonna attract a lot of attention. up anything useful. Stop right there! Stay where you are! Hey, hey, easy there, friend. We're not infected. You're alive? I didn't think there was anyone living left out there. Come on, follow me. If you're looking for the evacuation point, you're too late. It's closed. Colonel White's orders. Yeah, actually, we were. Don't worry. This is an old bomb shelter, very well fortified. It was the evacuation point for anyone exposed to the disease. They were examined and quarantined in hopes that help would arrive. But the contagion spread. And finally, they told us to shut this place down. What, shut it down? What about the infected? Yeah, we were ordered to kill them. Every last one of them. To halt the spread. But then we lost contact with command. No way to call in evac. Nothing on the radio at all. Well, that's probably because of the monsoon. Maybe. Shut the fuck up, you maggots! It's a miracle we found this place at all. Major Dixon's talking to the troops. He's our commanding officer. We will do what is necessary to survive. We have enough weapons and ammo to kill everyone on this godforsaken island ten times over. We have enough food to last us for years. We are self-sufficient. And we will fight together until we've drawn our last breath. Yes, sir! So what, what kind of arena are you talking about exactly? They're survivors, Major. We have four arenas full of starving infected who would tear us apart like rabid dogs if given half a chance. Each arena is set up to offer soldiers the ultimate test. The task is to kill all the infected before they can kill you. There's only one rule, survival. Yeah, I'm not sure I see the point of this. It's a test of courage. A rite of passage. We execute our last order and slaughter the infected. And those who fight best will be rewarded. Only the strong will survive. What are you lollygagging for? Get to work! It's not easy out there. Don't let any of these assholes fool you. Fuck off! There used to be a bomb shelter, an ammo depot. Now it's more like a giant obstacle course. You better have more to f
missiles go dead! supposed to get the fuck off this island, not hike deep into the goddamn jungle. We need Moen for that. Trust me, he's the only one who can get you past those floating mines. Do what he wants, and he'll do what you want. Get him to the bloody lab! This isn't only about what Moen wants, is it, White? You're pushing us there for another reason. Don't you understand? Each one of you has had contact with these things, and none of you have gotten sick. Your blood could be used to make some sort of antidote to save my wife. She's still alive? They gave us something, some medicine. But 
don't know what it is. It slows down the process, but not forever. The doctors in the lab could use the antibodies in your blood to create some sort of cure. It may be Emily's only chance. What the fuck? Well, what do we do? We do what's right. We do the right thing. Pona, you are a police officer. You protected those who couldn't protect themselves. This is your path. Jin, you're more full of compassion than any of us. You know what it's like to lose someone you love. What do you want to do? I don't fucking care. Well, I do. Time to step up, Logan. You in the game, or warming the bench? Sam B? Yeah, I hear you. We a crew. We hang together, but we fucked. All right, then. Let's do this.